Hi everybody, welcome to my channel. My name is Janie. If you're new here, I do videos on Squishmallow, Squishables, Build-A-Bear, Launchfly, Sanrio. Basically anything that I think is cute. Lately, I've been sprinkling in some hair care and skincare videos. Right, I'm super excited about today's video. We're talking about some plushies. I have not opened them yet. So there's a backstory to this. A couple months ago, I was on Instagram and I found the cutest little clown plushie that was still in production. This is like a small business owner who was getting them manufactured herself and she had a circus dog dog and then later she came out with a circus clown and she started a kickstarter i backed up that kickstarter but i'm super unfamiliar and i'm always messing something up so i signed up for both plushies and then you she unlocked a couple other stretch goals so you were able to like add a keychain or add a beanie depending on what you wanted so i added a keychain and i thought that means I was getting the keychain with the plushie, but I must have messed up because basically, long story short, my pledge ended up changing and I ordered just the keychain and not the plushies. So the Kickstarter ended and I didn't realize my mistake until much later. Luckily, she did have some extra plushies and she put them up on her Etsy shop. And that is what we're opening today along with that lollipop, I mean the keychain. I almost spoiled it. Um, I have some craft scissors because I don't know where my other ones are, but just wanted to open it on camera. I thought it would be more special. This took forever to get here. I think USBS just has been very slow lately, but that is nobody's fault. I see them and they're so cute. All right, should we start off with the dog first? Let's do it. Oh my goodness. I think his name is Blue. He is so cute. Oh, your ear. Okay, wow, he is the cutest. Yeah, his name is Blue the Circus Dog. I forgot to mention the company. This is Mara de Luna. Um, I'm thinking that's how you say it. She's from Oregon, and I love her artwork. She sells prints. She sells a bunch of things, but I was focused on the plushies for right now, and later we'll place a different order. But look at this little circus plushie. I love circus themes i love carnivals i don't really like any animal aspects to actual circuses in real life i do not support them but the confetti not the confetti the cotton candy cute carnival games i love that part so this dog is so cute it has these floppy ears this cute little hat that i do believe yeah it is removable um but i honestly think he looks cuter with the hat on and in this cute little collar purple and pink all around Oh my goodness, it is so cute. It has some blue spots on its body and a blue tail. Very floppy. Kind of looks like a beaver tail. Hmm. And a red nose. It is so cute. And look at the tag because she has a lot of like little artwork and stuff. How cute is this? Oh, it feels good to finally have it because I almost after I missed out on the Kickstarter, I was just kind of so irritated in myself that I didn't I wasn't going to place this order. And after seeing it on Etsy for a bit, like just sitting there, I was like, I have to get this. And then it ended up selling out. I'm assuming it'll eventually come back in stock just because these are such popular stuffed animals. She also has a lot of other plushies like this cute little ghost and stuff. But this right here, circus plushies, this is what I wanted. And it is so cute. I'm trying to see. Yeah so cute it has some freckles here you can't really tell with the way the fur is sitting but i like it i'm excited all right and then like i said after she came out with that one she released a cat version as well and i wanted this scent and i really do love cats so let's take a look at this bad boy right here i don't remember the name of this one all right this is ferris the clown cat how cute i feel like the head is bigger than I thought. It's a chunky cat. All right, so Ferris. Oh, there's its hat. Oh my goodness. my goodness. There we go. I knew something looked a little funny. It does look good without the hat, but I, I just kind of like it because I feel like it adds a little something. So here's a bright blue hat with a little heart. Oops, oops. Little purple ears that are getting crushed. Okay, purple ears, blue hat with pink heart. It has that hot pink and blue collar and purple spots all along the body a curly little tail and it's it's really cute so we have ferris and blue i don't know which one i like better though okay i think i know so on paper like in pictures i want i like blue better but in person i kind of like ferris i don't know little red whiskers i'm honestly impressed i think that's the best part of finding plushies on instagram and like on websites is that there's something like homemade and special about them just like my chicken right here 
I these are some of my favorite plushies. Like yes, I collect squishmallows and build a bears and lash flies, but these tend to be a little bit more unique, like circus plushies. I think that's so fun. So this is the Kickstarter keychain that I ended up signing up for accidentally instead of the plushies. So we can just open this up, even though these scissors are not meant for this. I waited to open this for the video review. And also because at the time I was sad that I was dumb enough not to realize, oh my gosh, this is so cute. This is so much cuter than I expected. All right, so there's Mar de Luna's um, thank you card. It says thank you so much. And then it has her Etsy, her website, and all her social media. It's one of her most popular uh, characters. And she also sells these like snail plushy purses. So cute. But look at this keychain. This is what I mean, like blue looks so good. Cute, I almost don't even want to wrap it because it looks like a lollipop. And I just like that bow detailing. Oh, this is so cute. Should we open it, guys? So that's the keychain part where it just clips. Should I don't know if we should open this. I oh, carefully pop it out. And there it is. It's like a acrylic keychain. I kind of want to see if I can put that plastic back on, honestly, because <laughs> the packaging was so cute. Yes, yeah, so this is what I mean. Blue just looks really cute, like in all the illustrations. I would love a blue notebook or something. This is so cute. Okay, so along with that, there's some other things like a phone grip and stuff that I didn't end up getting. So that is it for this video. I will have all the social media links down below. Like I said, I paid for this with my own money. This is this is my own thoughts and I'm really happy I bought them. I think they're really cute. So let me know what you think down below. Do you buy any plushies that you see on Instagram or like other websites? Let me know what you find if you like anything other than like the traditional Squishmallows, Builder Bear, Lounge Fly, stuff like that. And that being said, give this video a like if you enjoyed and until next time, stay safe out there. Bye.